Class the attribute is often used to point to a class name in a style sheet. It can also be used by a JavaScript to access and manipulate element with a specific class name. So as you can see right here, here we have a div. So we already talked about div. Here we have div and the class attribute, here it is, and class name is city. So you can see. So and these are the elements inside the div class by using this so we, when we want to access using the css to these elements we need to first access to the class to this class as you can see right here so the class attribute can be used in any html elements you can also use this class name for h1 h2 or p element and any other element you prefer and you want and the class name is case sensitive you can if you use lower case and capital and all everything is same so when you want to access to this class using the style sheet first you need to add the uh, dot character and then the class name and then curly braces right here and inside the curly braces you can use the properties of css the changes that you want to add to your class or your div whatever you are using the class for and when we jump over to the page so this is the page that we have style right here so you can use the class for for a specific element you want and you can access using the class by style sheet and you can use the multiple classes uh, for your single html element you can have multiple classes like let me check see that city and let's use the panda so if i add some changes let me add some changes right here using let me copy this and paste it here london so let me save this and let's refresh so as you can see because I have used this London in this um, single div that's why changes added into first element not the two other elements so you can see right here and uh, this is the way of using the multiple classes if you can also use the multiple multiple classes for a single element so let me control Z this save this uh, to define a multiple class you can separate using the with using the space as I have added right here and uh, if you want to have multiple class name for a single div or single element you can separate the class's name by using the spaces and also you can use the multiple uh, for multiple elements you can just use the single class name as you can see there are uh, for three div element I have used just one single class so I can so if I use one class name for our element the changes that i add for our one element will add it to our all of them so as you can see if i use one class name for multiple elements the changes that i added will add it to all elements that i'm using their the class name for changes the class name here and let's save this and now what we're going to do we're going to add this to Paris and let's copy this again and paste it here that's why I'm because I want to use different classes for every single elements to show you what will happen so let's use that so black color will white and red green so that's it now let's refresh this so as you can see if i use multiple classes name for multiple elements we can add for every element a different color or size or different uh, fonts for example if you 